can you solve this geometry challenge? Here's the question. Given this square, take note that we have four quarter circles with a radius of 3 inches and four semicircles with a diameter of 4 inches. Now the question, if we add this four blue shaded region and subtract the sum of this four orange shaded region, now the question is what is their difference? Now you can pause this video if you want to give this problem a try. Now suppose you pause this video and have the answer. Now let's see if your answer is correct. All right. Now to answer this question, of course, we will use algebra. Yes, you heard it right. Even though this is a geometry question, we will use algebra to answer this kind of question. So, let x be equal to this shape, to this blue shaded region. Therefore, all of this, 1, 2, 3, 4, they are all equivalent to x. Also, let y be equal to this orange shaded region. So, all of this, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, all of this shaded region must be equal to y, like this. So, our question now, this becomes 4x minus 4y, and that is now our goal. So, we convert this geometry question into an algebra question. So, 4x minus 4y equals what? So, that is what we want to find now. Now, to get the value of this expression, we need two equations. And those equations will come from to the area of this semicircle and the area of this quarter circle. But before that, notice this shape like over here. Those are just the same thing. So let z be equal to this shape. Why not? So now, we will use the area first of the quarter circle. So this is one of the quarter circle. Now the question is what is the area of this quarter circle? So we have 2z plus x equals the area of this quarter circle must be computed by this formula, 1 fourth pi r squared. Now the question, do we have the radius of this quarter circle? And the answer is yes. This given which is 3 inches. So we can replace this r with 3. Now, 3 squared, this is just 9. We all know that. So the area of this quarter circle, 1 of the quarter circle, must be equal to 9 over 4 times pi. Now, since we have 4 quarter circle, what we're going to do is to multiply this whole equation by 4, like this. Now, 4 times 2z is 8z, and 4 times x, this will give us 4x. And 4 multiplied by 9 over 4 times pi, this will give us 9 pi. So we have now one equation that contains 4x that we need to answer this expression. Alright, now let's set aside this result. And then for the other equation, let's use the area of the semicircle. So one semicircle, this is the example of one semicircle, and the area of this must be equal to 2z plus y and the area of the semicircle must be given by this formula, 1 half times pi r squared. Now the question, do we know the radius of the semicircle? And the answer is yes. Since given its diameter of 4 inches, therefore its radius must be equal to half of 4 inches, which is 2 inches. So we can replace this r with 2. Now, 2 squared, this will give us 4. 1 over 2 times pi times 4, this will give us 2 pi. So our second equation is 2z plus y equals 2 pi, or the area of the semicircle. But since we have 4 semicircles, again, let's multiply both sides by 4. And 4 times 2z is 8z, and 4 times y is 4y. And 4 times 2 pi, this will give us 8 pi. Now, Let's compare these two equations. And what we're going to do to get the value of this expression, of course, we need to subtract them. 
And if we do that, we cancel out 8C and 8C. This is just 0. And 9 pi minus 8 pi, this is just pi. So the resulting equation, if we subtract these two equations, becomes 4x minus 4y equals pi. And take note, 4x minus 4y is what we need to find. And the equivalent is just pi. Therefore, our answer to this question, what is the difference between the sum of the blue shaded region and the orange shaded region and the answer and their difference must be equal to pi square inches. And that is the answer to this question. And as always, we are done.